Gentlemen, good evening and uh, welcome to the press conference. Coach in preparation for the victory. May I ask you to give us your analysis? Um, yeah, well, coming in, we knew that nobody had won here this year, Brussels, and uh, we've had trouble offensively for, for quite a while. And even today, we didn't shoot the ball that well, but our defense has consistently been growing and getting better. And I think we fed off that today. And we did make shots at the right time under, you know, timely shots. It wasn't a great shooting performance, but when we really needed a basket, we found a way to, to make it. Um, and I, you know, they took the lead at the end of the first half and uh, it seemed like they had the momentum. I, I think the halftime came probably at a, the wrong time for them and the right time for us. And we were able to gather ourselves at halftime and, and, and really come out with a lot of energy. And I, I like the way we fought and, um, and, and worked. And the point guards, of course, Jeremy Anderson's not here, but uh, between uh, Kean Anderson and, and Naeem, I thought they, they worked very hard on defense and they had 10 assists between our two point guards, which is always a good thing. So, uh, yeah, you know, we continue to, to struggle a little bit offensively, but it doesn't break our will or our spirit. And, and uh, no matter what happens or what is written about us or what's going on in the internet or whatever it is, the guys continue to, to, to be pretty tight. It's a pretty tight group. They, they, uh, they fight for one another. And, uh, yeah, uh, we needed to win, and I'm happy about it. Thank you. Well, first of all, congratulations to uh, Coach Dean and to, to the team of AST. I think, like Coach said, uh, they fought a little bit better than us, a little bit more. The, the energy was more on their side. The consistency in defense was, was a little bit better on their side. Um, and, and we didn't have a good offensive game, but I think it's also due to the, the defense from the, uh, the opponent tonight. We have to be honest about it. Um, we have an unusual high number of turnovers, wrong moment, wrong timing. We have a, we have a break, we have a fast break. We turn the ball over a couple of times. We can come back in the game. We don't. And like Coach said, they 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 hit big shots. When we had a lot of energy, at the end of the possession, they hit like Tofi in the corner. He's two feet on the three-point line. He makes it. It was it's really tough when you play hard defense. Two, three times in a row, they hit a big shot like this on your face. Uh, we're not yet ready to overcome such a situation. Now that's what we have to work on. You know, it's no drama. We have to learn from what happened today. We have to be able to, they hit, we have to hit back. Or we have to hit first. We have to be, make it more physical. When the game is not beautiful, we cannot play our, our flow offense the way we like to play it. We have to change the face of the game. And they, they were able to do it. Like we said, they struggle offensively, they fight defensively. We have to learn doing that. this also. I think, I think it's a learning process for us. We're still in the race for the top five. Obviously, it, it hurts a little bit today. We're gonna, like I said, analyze, come back strong on Monday and prepare the game as, much, as, as good as we can for Friday in Liege. There's nothing else we can do. But we're gonna analyze and try to get better.